Phil Russo of NAFA gives us an update on the organization's Beyond Fleet program. I'd be happy to bring you up to date on Beyond Fleet. The program that promotes fleet management and fleet managers to the world, not just to the industry itself, but to the outside world, to show people the value of a good fleet manager and the value of fleet management in an organization, whether it's a government organization or a corporate organization. NAF is taking on this huge public relations program. This year it's really gotten a lot of steam. Um, with We launched it at our annual conference at INE, the Institute and Expo in St. Louis. In conjunction with the launch of the program, we had some radio spots in St. Louis that actually drew some people into the conference, which was nice. It was a nice little added benefit. Uh, we started print production. We started press releases that started going out in April, in May, and June. In July, we went big time. We went on the radio in New York City, one of the world's largest radio markets, um, and had huge, huge uh, feedback and, and some great, great feedback from members who heard it as they're driving into work. As a result of the New York City radio spots, we've had a couple of New Jersey publications that have reached out to us, as well as other organizations that have reached out to us and said, what is this thing called fleet management and who are you, who is NAFA? So we've heard from the General Accountability Office from Congress, who is looking to do benchmarks and best practices for the, for the federal fleet. We've heard from the EPA, and we've heard from even groups as diverse as the Sierra Club, who want to know what is this thing called NAFA and what is this thing called Beyond Fleet, and what should our fleet managers be doing because we all have fleet managers.